Hi everybody. 2023 BMW 3 Series. What's new? Updated exterior styling. Digital instrument panel and larger touch screen now share a single curved housing. Fewer buttons, with more functions move to the touch screen. BMW's intelligent personal assistant gains new functionality. Part of the 7th 3 Series generation introduced for 2019. The 7th generation BMW 3 Series has been on sale for a few years, which means it was time for BMW to give it a feature refresh to keep it competitive against the recently redesigned Mercedes-Benz C-Class. We knew a styling update would be in the picture for the 2023 BMW 3 Series and feared the beaver toothed grille from the 4 Series and M3 slash M4 would transition to the mild-mannered luxury sedan, too. Thankfully, BMW hasn't fussed with the exterior too much the grille is slightly wider than before, the headlight cluster no longer has the little notch in the middle, and the front and rear bumpers feature sharper angles, giving it a more modern look. There are significant changes to the interior, however. For starters, the 12.3-inch digital instrument panel and central touchscreen now share a singular curved housing running BMW's latest iDrive 8 software. The new software makes the BMW intelligent personal assistant smarter, with improved natural language voice recognition and additional features, including the ability to open and close the windows or the sunroof through verbal commands. Finally, the central screen is upgraded to measure 14.9 inches nearly double the size of the previously standard 8.8 inch screen and once again offers touch functionality. BMW has also streamlined the center stack control layout. There are almost zero dedicated physical controls for the climate system. Instead, these functions are moved to the touch screen in a climate menu, though the driver and passenger temperatures are always displayed. We're not huge fans of making attention sapping touch screens even more convoluted, but at least you can use the car's voice recognition system to change the temperature. The useful set of 8 preset buttons, which can be configured for anything from radio stations to navigation destinations and specific menus, also disappears. Lastly, the shift lever has been replaced by a toggle switch. All these changes make for a compelling entrant into the compact luxury sedan segment, but the 3 Series will face stiff competition from the redesigned Mercedes-Benz C-Class, the stylish Audi A4 and the up-and-coming Genesis G70. Read on for our thoughts on how the updated 3 Series fares. Which 3 Series does recommend? If you have a spot to plug it in, the BMW 330e is our recommendation. Its price isn't much higher than the base 3 Series, yet it comes equipped with a plug-in hybrid powertrain supplying an estimated 23 miles of pure electric driving before switching to gas-electric hybrid operation. And models manufactured in North America may qualify for a federal tax credit and potentially other incentives, for new car buyers, these incentives could actually make it the least expensive 3 Series. Thank you for watching. Leave a comment below and let us know what you thought of the video. We'll see you in the next one.